guys, what's up? Seg here. Welcome back to my Cool Cat Super Mario Bros. PC playthrough. I'm gonna... I decided to just use Bandicam instead, because... Why not? It doesn't lag as much. My computer is nice. Oh, uh, Mario again. Anyway, today I'm going to try to beat World 2. Let's see if I'm able to do that or not. First off, you can tell the level design is still just as spammy as it has been. Uh, yeah, so that's nice. I'm joined commentating by Dave and Nick. So, hi guys. Uh, don't even know if you can hear them or not. Anyway. Uh, crap. That's why I didn't use my raccoon power just yet. Uh, now I'm gonna use it, but I'm only gonna use it to get a fire flower. Watch this. Bam. Now I can continue using my fire power, and I'll still also still have my raccoon, so that's nice. Uh, yeah. Sorry if the volume's too loud. I let Bandicam take over with the computer noise, because my, I turned my music off in my head, so. This level's weird at the end. So anyway, does that level for you? Anyways. And, yeah, the next level is you have a choice between the pyramid and the sky level, I believe. Let me just make sure it's the sky level. Yeah. I like the pyramid. Because it's a pyramid. Let's see. Uh, there we go. This is a much better power for this level. Sorry if there's background noise. There's a little bit of stuff going on in the background. We all love raccoons. Whoa. Just gonna... For some reason, going down that pipe results in. Oh, whoa. Since the shell physics in this game are so cool, I don't think you're actually able to do the infinite one-up trick. I have not actually tested it, so don't take my word for it if you know otherwise. Oh, sorry, my mouse. Anyways, time to beat the fortress. Actually, no, I'm going to do a 100% completion playthrough. Meaning I am indeed going to play through Desert Sky, despite its retardedness. Okay then, well I guess Dave is kind of somewhat commentating. And bam! The shortest level in the world you win the second you you spawn. So it'll be a minute second long actually. Not even a second. Anyway, now that I'm in here, I'm gonna hate this hundred percent completion. I, I should have never promised that to myself. Because I just remembered exactly how crap how crappy the world 4 is with its options. It gives you the world's hardest level or the world's even harder level. Ah! How was I supposed to do that? That that was impossible. Wait, did you make this? Yes. That doesn't mean I'm professional at it. I am just... I know how to do it, but things just time themselves really badly. I guarantee you that time things time themselves really badly in this game. Oh, uh, collect a 
this before I proceed. There we go. I'm pretty sure there should be a Banzai Bill spawner over there. Come on, already? Death to Boom Boom. But that but that So most of this game is Super Mario most of the Desert World is Super Mario Bros. 3 style. Well, most of the the jungle world, which is world three, is not as much so. Anyways. Time to play the next level, which I believe is the dunes level. Yep. Free one ups. No, oh, I, I don't like this level if you don't have raccoon power. Super Leaf is amazing. I'm glad they reintroduced it in New Super Mario Bros. 2. Or technically Super Mario 3D Land as a Tanuki suit. That was not a real Tanuki suit, it was a lie. It, first of all, it didn't let you fly, second of all, it didn't let you turn into a statue. They did have a metal statue suit, I think so. Hey! Stop making random commentating that doesn't have anything to do with it! Nick, stop using random objects to add random commentary that is completely unrelated. Anyway, back to the commentary. The heck? <laughs> yeah, um... There we go. So the last level I have left is naturally a castle, and I have... I don't know. Never mind. I still have to play sand blocks. Watch this. Bam. Bamity bam bam. Stop making miscellaneous background noise. It's annoying. Sorry, they're playing with a stuffed snake. And I don't want any messed up immature comments about that. But um ch Okay, here's the castle that I have roughly two and a half minutes to complete. Should work. There we go. This is gonna be much better. I think. Hopefully. Oh, 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 I reckon. Raccoons. Oh, I think this is that really long castle. Is it? Yes, it is. It's the one where it also has the vertical scrolling part. This level was pretty innovative by my standards at that time. Sorry if there's really obnoxious background noise. There's bound to be background noise in my videos because I am in like the least soundproof room in the house. In other words, a non-soundproof room. Um, I get that. Lemmy is probably the hardest boss in this game. Besides Bowser, obviously. That is it. Uh, no! Ah, oh, crap! Darn it, Lemmy. He's the tallest boss, making him incredibly hard to jump on. So, that would explain- uh, oh, ugh. He's really easy to get spammed by. Example given, 10 seconds ago. Oh well, that was perfect timing. Whoa, that was cool. I did not see that coming. Anyway, so I'm just gonna try to get through this again. Level design's kind of weird in this level, but I mean, the playability is pretty good. Unless you're not very good at Mario. And I'm just gonna let it do its thing. If this level was timed, this would be a pain to get past. But Super Mario Bros. X doesn't time. Which is nice. Super Mario Bros. X does not time your levels. 
Anyway, this video is longer than 10 minutes, I noticed. It's because I had to movie maker two parts together. Now, oh, isn't that nice? There we go. Oh, I'm gonna move my mouse out of the way. That was- that's- that's gonna kill me in the long run. Oh! Ha! Beat Lemmy. Round of applause. Standing ovation! So anyway, now that I've beaten World 2, I'll see you next time.